been together for a little over four years, and I can't wait to marry him. But Garrett is incarcerated in the Florida Department of Corrections for drugs and burglary and theft charges. And he was sentenced to eight years. Uh, he only ended up doing about six and a half. I don't care what people think about me, you know? Yes, I am a 24-year-old man who's been incarcerated the majority of his childhood. I'm not some upright, you know, perfect, all-American guy, you know? But I get out of here tomorrow. I can't wait to get the hell up out of here. I'm a little nervous with my dad. He flips out and storms out, and I just don't really want it to be that kind of situation. John is there. He's a character. I've never met him. Only heard what John talks about. You know, I feel like he doesn't know as much as he thinks he knows, and that's the worst kind of person. It's pretty important to me that the two most important men in my life get along, and... You're both number one in different ways. Uh -oh. I found Garrett when I had one too many glasses of Moscato and decided to look up guys online. I came across his mugshot. And um, once I saw his mugshot, I was like, wow, this guy takes a really hot mugshot. So I just was like, you know, what's it going to kill me to write him a letter? Well, anyways, it's getting so close. He's going to finally be a free man. Uh, no, can't wait. There's just so many firsts coming up. I've never lived with a woman. I've been waiting to have sex since pretty much the day I went in, and I can't wait to get to the house. You know, we can do what we got to do. You know, sexy time, as she would say. You're gonna finally get to love this free now. Oh, I love you anyway, free or not free. <laughs>